First, a teacher in serious trouble. Officers telling us he crossed the line with a young female student. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jamison Euler. And I'm Wendy Ryan. Thanks for joining us. First tonight, disturbing new developments in a story we've been following since October. Police first charged Robert Celeste with having sex with a 16-year-old student, and now they're telling us he's fathered her child. That's right. ABC Action News reporter Michael Paluska live in Pinellas County with the very latest out there. Michael? Jamison, Wendy, St. Pete police have been working this case for several months. They say that DNA evidence finally makes it clear, despite some of the stories they've been told, they're now running forward with those charges of unlawful sexual activity against a minor. Robert Celeste was booked into the Pinellas County Jail and charged with unlawful sexual activity with a minor. This is his picture from November 20th. St. Petersburg police say they knew Celeste had sex with a 16-year-old student in the district, but now say DNA evidence of that student's newborn baby matches Celeste. That is the key piece of evidence in the case they have been waiting for. I'm with ABC Action News. Are you able to comment about the new information coming out? Is your lawyer available to talk to us? Okay, thank you. Celeste would not comment at his seminal home about the DNA results showing he is the child's father. Investigators say his relationship with the 16-year-old started back in 2014 when he was a teacher at Northeast High School. A short time later is when Celeste put in his transfer to Pinellas Park. He resigned as a teacher two months before he was arrested last year. And Celeste is due in court here for a pretrial hearing that will be on March 7th at 8.30 a.m. We're live here in Clearwater tonight. Michael Paluska, ABC Action News.